we've been working on this uh, uh, problem of how to do live production exchange. So, um, what's the problem we're trying to solve? If you take um, Prime Minister's question time, what is it? It's got event information, date, time, source, you've got tech specs, but it's abstracted from the technical information about where the source is coming from, if it's on a satellite, all that kind of stuff, um, which is further abstracted from the content information, what the Prime Minister's question time is likely to be about, and then the transcript of what happened afterwards. So, meaning, somebody or thing has to join everything up. Booking all the different resources, the BT Tower lines, fiber lines, the MAM, you've got to give it a name, you've got internal resources, and then you've got to sync up that content information that the news agencies will often put out with that recorded content, with that uh, material that you've recorded. And then, of course, things change. People say something that was unexpected, it wasn't as planned, it goes longer, whatever it is, we all know it happens, and you've got to do it all again. So, lots of opportunity for error and effort to fix. We think there must be a better way. Single MPA, describing all information related to an event that is sufficiently expressive to allow changes to be accommodated as an event develops. Kind of simple, when I've shown this to many people, they just turn around to me, you guys haven't solved this already? So, we needed a schema. Actually, an organization called the IPTC has already done loads and loads of work in this space. They've been around since the 70s. They did original Newswire stuff. So we decided to use them and uh, their events ML, news ML schema, but that's all XML. We want to do Ninja, uh, we want to do JSON. So we are, chose NinjaS, but we've had to put lots of work and effort to translate a lot of that stuff, analyze existing workflows and add fields to uh, make it sufficiently expressive. Our implementation, that is our Kivas one, will use RESTful API using OpenAI. We're focusing on news first, sports next, and then entertainment. Um, and then later we'll be adding it to one of our products called Arcade. So, how do we actually get people across this? We thought, well, let's do a hackathon. So, um, on Monday we did a call uh, with us, Reuters, and a bunch of other people where we released some the documentation and a reference implementation. It's all there. Um, the We're doing an in-person hackathon on the 4th of March <laughs> at Reuters HQ, but we can all still, everyone can, can come join this already now. Nick Brandon, Tim have already been heavily involved with us on this, this has been terrific. And the goal is to demonstrate the exchange of LPX event information, me metadata, sorry, between different implementations. Um, and if firms don't have developers, eCreation have been working with us on this, Mirapar have been working on this, and they're quite au fait with all of this, so you can get them to help you. Um, that's it. I hope that's informative. Thanks, Dan. What do you think? Let us know in the comments. And don't forget to subscribe for more.